Why, hello everyone! Welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. We finally cleared our case ledger, and just finally, <laughs> the schedule's not packed. At last, we can start doing stuff for us, start taking some Aloy time. And the first thing that I want to do, now that we're, we're back out here kind of in the old stomping grounds for a bit, first thing I want to do is find out what on earth this thing is. This power cell, a battery designed for a mid-21st century military hololock. Now, I don't remember exactly where I got this, because I've had it for a while. What I might have gotten it from is, like, uh, kind of early on after the second week of recording, I think. I did some wandering around back in the uh, original early Embrace starting area. I did wind up back down in those ruins we went in before. That might be where I found it. Uh, but I may have found it in one of these other things, too. It's been a while, and I found a lot of things and been a lot of places. I can't be expected to remember everything. Come on. I'm a detective, not a computer. Anyway, so I have that thing, and now it gave me this quest to go to the ancient armory because an ancient suit of armor lies in a ruin of the old ones, visible but out of reach. I'm to find a use for the power cell, and I'm very curious about that. And apparently I'm supposed to find a use for that in here somewhere. So, let's go a-looking. Boy, it's so nice being back here. I remember when this place felt dangerous. How quaint. I was like, oh no, striders, I better hide. Yeesh. Uh, where am I going? I mean, this looks promising down here. Sort of. Uh... Yeah, it looks like it could be something, right? No. Let's see. Oh yeah, this has got to be something. Oh, we're going down there totally. Let's see. Yes, and yes. I wonder what's down here. I wonder that too. Looks neat. Scared to jump. I mean, it's probably water down there, but, um... I don't know, Aloy, how much you feel like rolling the dice on that? Let's, uh, drop to a ledge. Try climbing. This seems like a more smart thing to do. And uh, drop. There we go. Okay, it was water, but... Good to play it safe sometimes. Wait, why music? What's going on? Hey, metal flower, nice. Can't scare me like that, composer. I'll shake it out later. Oh, right, this reminds me. I found a particular merchant back in town that I hadn't seen before, uh, who is interested in... Weird. Who is interested in these, uh, flower-type things. These, uh, yeah, these metal flowers I've been finding. Uh, and it's sort of like the, uh, sort of like the mug, uh, merchant fellow. Uh, if I bring a certain number of them to that uh, particular merchant, he'll give me like a little, uh... And it's not really a loot box, but I guess it kind of is. You know what I mean. A bunker discovered. Huh. This isn't a cave. It's a room. Yes. Oh, I'm interested. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Armor. From the age of the old ones. But how do I get to it? How indeed. Ultra weave armor, eh? I want in there. So, let's see. How to do this. Um... I haven't seen one of these since I was a little kid. Yeah. Okay. These devices are missing power cells. Aha! Uh -huh. have to find power cells to get these to work. Well, I found one. There. Fits. Nice. I just need, need one more. In one more. Yeah. What's this? I think the old ones use numbers like this to indicate time. Hmm. Interesting. 
Well, I guess I won't be getting much further in until I find another one of these cells. Somewhere. Maybe in ruins of some sort, but yeah. Red light. I'm not getting in. I kind of just want to get out, actually. But cool. I will be back to claim you later, armor. Just you wait. Ultra weave trials. Huh. Ultra weave Mark 7.1 trials, October 65th. Oh <laughs> uh, no, it's October. It's. 2065, I guess. Pass threshold, 85 out of 100. Ballistic test, 91. Shrapnel test, 87. Seems pretty good. Weave is not tightening properly on local impact tests. We need to optimize existing sensors or add more. Neat. Getting there on the weave density and detection components, but an integration error on the left knee tanked the impact test. Ouch. Subject isn't going to be able to walk on that, that one off. Surgery required. Well, it may not be a perfect set of armor, but it sounds cool and I want it. Someday. Let's get out of here. Boy, oh boy, does it feel good to have our quest log under control again. Feels great. Let's do some main quests. How exciting. So, City of the Sun. This is the one where we need to find Olin. Gotta go to the excavation site. Uh, Aloy journeys to Meridian in search of Olin, the Osram scrounger she met the night before the proving. Somehow the killers targeted her through Olin's focus, a mystery she can only solve by finding him and making him talk. We know that they're holding his family, and, uh, yeah. So, he is somewhere in here, theoretically. So, uh, let's go find him. There's a bunch of Shadow Karja and corrupted stuff around, which kind of sucks, but, uh, we'll make do. Here. That's right. I'm the one what did it. And I got fire arrows for your corrupted dorks who just stunned you, I think. That seemed not intended. Be on fire, some dork. While I work on your buddies. When I jump, I get really good at arrows. Have y'all tried the jumping trick? It works. Loser. Okay, well. That's that. Now let's see if we can get into this excavation site. Without too much trouble. Ravager. Hmm. Ravager plus several, it seems like. Shell walkers also. Like three of them. That's more than I bargained for. Let's go this way. I think this is the actual direction anyway. Cultist priests. Not for long. What's that weapon they got there? Move along now. We're under attack! Well, you sure turned around quick. Fall over dead. Thank you. Well, I better stock up on the meds, huh? Given my track record. Okay, let's be good little sleuths. Sneaky now. Folks could be anywhere. Yoo-hoo. This is what you intend. To bring these ancient things back to life. Their power serves us. Machine demons from beneath the ground. It's a nightmare. Nightmares, yes. The worst dreams of our enemies come true. Yes, rise. Yay, more of those. So 
much for catching him alone. These things will destroy us all! They will only destroy our enemies and bring us back the lands that were taken. Ah! Stop working. First the area. We may have intruders. Oh boy. Forgive this intrusion, Aloy. You left me no choice. Hey. <sighs> Who is this? An interested party. Now the focuses are disabled, but I don't know for how long. The rest is up to you. Who is this? I know that voice. Hang on. Lance Reddick, that's the guy, yeah. Oh, I love his voice. Great actor with a great old voice. Let's see if we can get through this without dying. And let's do a little reading up just in advance. Corruptors, right. Weak to fire. They got that grenade launcher, which I could rip off. Also that spike launcher attack. Uh, and a heat core. If I heat them up enough, it'll expose that. And then I can uh, do a lot of damage to it. So hit them. Rip these two things off, hit them with fire. Bam. Done. Can. Do. So, let's see here. Boy, folks everywhere. Gonna be hard to do a stealthy approach with that one up there. I wonder if there's a way around. Up and around would be great. Take those two out. I guess... I could use the sniper arrows, but I'd really rather not... ...leave that to chance. Oh, hey, I didn't even see you before. The Nora girl lives. Kill her! No! You Watch had it. your chance. Oh, what? Wait. Olin, did you do something stupid? Olin, you did do something stupid. Alright, well... Olin, I think they might just be killing you over and over for a while, so... Enjoy that hell, I guess. Anything out there? Come on, then. Shoot. Well, he tried. Goodbye. All right, fine. We're going loud. How's it going, Olin? Feeling alive? I will teach you to play. Teach me to what? I want to know. I learned nothing. Okay, well, let's see. Get him, Owen. <laughs> That's the spirit. Got that one. And... Got... That one. Ah, you moved. You moved, and that's the worst. Don't be moving. Ah. Get hit. Ow, oh, don't duck, loser. Ow. It's quite the rock you just threw. Let's uh, take some of your abilities away, huh? That's what I'd like to do right about now. Great. They're still throwing things, I think. I better move. How's it going, Olin? Okay. I don't know if they lost their stuff. I don't think they did. Boo. Stop having stuff. That didn't seem to be working. Let's, um... Try this, I guess? Well, they lost one thing. Lose the other thing. There we go. That's better. Now be on fire, please. 
Yikes. Jumps. Let's move. This is not a good place to be. Olin, how's it going with the humans? Have you killed all the humans? Olin, do you think it could help me with the humans? Thank you, Olin. Okay. Olin, maybe run for cover, okay, bud? This is going to be hairy. Watch it. Nope. Hate it. Okay, you still have, like, dangerous gear, and I hate that. Break, please. Oh, boy, nope. Okay. Hate it. Y'all are both corrupted. That's probably what's making this harder, huh? Ah, got it. Okay. Oy. No fun. Let's see if I can plant a trap or something. They're just going to jump over it, but, you know, better than nothing. Whew. Yeah, come chase, please. Thank you. I get damaged. You still have a weapon, don't you? Oh, I hate it. You do still have a weapon. Shame on you for smuggling weapons in here. Oh, I think you lost it. Oh, and you're dead. Well, that worked out. What did I do to cause that? Ah, okay. You also have a weapon. Who keeps letting you keep weapons? I disapprove. Okay, hang on. That thing. I want you to not have it anymore. Uh, we jumped at the same time. Stop having that. Thank you. Now, start getting on fire. Ow. No rocks. No throwing rocks. This sucks. You know what? Maybe it's time for a change of strategy. Let's mix it up. Let's try a rope caster. Let's try pinning you to the ground. That could be fun. Haven't really tried that yet on you. Missed. Not a good start to rope caster times. Get pinned. Boy. Doing a real bad job getting pinned there, bud. Get pinned down. Yes, now. I can do some damage to you, which is great. Not nearly enough, but... Oh, cool, two for... Didn't know that was possible. Nah. Be on fire. Be on fire. Be on more fire, please. All right, temperature rising. Temperature rising. Not that it matters much. You barely got any health left. And you're dead. There it is. Still room for improvement, but I'm getting there. So, Olin. How was all that death? Feeling okay? You're looking a little worse for wear. I promise. I'll tell you everything. I know you will. So... Hmm, which one first? You know, I feel like I can probably figure out the killer's thing on my own with time. That one, though. The Eclipse were sent to kill me because I look like another woman. Older, maybe twice my age, short hair. Who is she? I don't know. My focus found her image once, in the ruins at Maker's End. Maybe you can find her there. You found her image in the ruins? How? There was a door beside it, a kind of ancient device that contained the woman's image. My focus recorded the location. You do look like her. Is she your mother? I'm the one asking questions. And finally, I can make someone give me answers. The killers who came for me at the Proving, who are they? The Eclipse. Some kind of holy warriors. A cult of the Shadow Karja. Shadow Karja? 
Except they're not like any Karja I've known. They don't pray to the sun. They worship some kind of devil. I'm not interested in their superstitions. Oh, it's not a superstition. Their devil is real. It has a name, a voice. The most terrible voice. And they do its bidding. Hmm. You say this devil, the Eclipse Worship, has a name? Hades. That's what they call it. Hades. And you've heard it speak? Steal to my soul. I heard. Just once, when it saw you. Such a voice. A cold, awful jangle. It scrapes your bones. It hollows your guts. A metal sound. But like nothing dug from the earth or smelted in a forge. And what did it say? System threat detected. Just three words. But in the voice of a devil. Hmm. What are these Eclipse cultists after, besides me? They never said. But given the Karja civil war, they must want to overthrow Sun King of Odd and take Meridian back. What do I have to do with that? I don't know. When they attacked the Proving, a man came for me. Tall, strong, dead eyes. He is. And who is he? The Terror of the Sun. Stacker of corpses, we Asuram called him, when he was the Mad Sun King's champion. <sighs> If only he'd died with his king. But now he leads the Eclipse. I tell you, he's the most dangerous man alive. Hmm. How did the Eclipse recruit you? I know they took your family hostage, but why you? I was a scrounger. A rummager in dark places. Good at what I do. I suppose they knew I would serve them well as a scout. I had taken a delve near Maker's End. When I surfaced, they were waiting. I laughed when I saw the priest. But then he showed me Helis's encouragement. I didn't laugh after that. They gave me a focus to watch my every move. I followed orders. You had access to Meridian. Why didn't they get to Avad through you? Too much dirt under my nails for an audience with the one true Sun King. But whatever Ursa or Aaron told me, the Eclipse heard every word through my focus. That's why I couldn't warn you. If I tried, they would have killed my family. Why are the Eclipse digging up ancient machines? And how do they get them to work? I thought they wanted them for scrap, but they brought them back to life. Plugged some kind of device into the corpses so that Hades could whisper to them and call them from their grave. I've fought that kind of machine before. Are there others? Yes. The ones you fought today they call corruptors, but there are others. Much bigger, bristling with ancient weapons. Those they call Deathbringers. I've only seen them buried in the ground, but after today, anything is possible. Sounds to me like they're raising an army. If so, the world will fall. And I helped dig the pit. Hmm. I've heard enough. It's time to finish this. I won't beg for my life. But if there's any mercy in you, free my family. Please. Where would I find them? My focus recorded the location. There are always guards there. You look like you can handle yourself. Hmm. This is complicated. Uh. All this time I tracked you down. I thought this decision would be simple. It's not. Your. Your role in events was coerced. Perhaps you're not an evil man, just a weak one. I am. The only strength I ever found in this life was my family. Death is what you've earned. And yet... I know what I deserve, Aloy. You shouldn't hesitate. Well, here, why don't you try redeeming yourself then? It will take many good deeds to make up for the crimes you've committed. You're sparing me? After all I've done? Yes. Forge a new life, Olin. One of better make. Then the rest of my life will be lived in your dead. Go to the place where your family is being held and wait for me. We'll make their lives the first ones you save. 
I didn't earn this mercy, but I will die to make myself worthy of it. I will be waiting for you. All right, then. Anything else I got to do in here? Other than clean house, I guess. I am intrigued by the Hades thing. System threat detected. So there, I'm guessing we've just got some sort of AI that is attempting to self-protect somehow. I, I'm sure my actual identity and origins are kind of key to understanding, a, to making a whole lot of the rest of the pieces fall into place, but uh, I suspect we won't be getting that for a little while. It's neat, though. I'm digging it. Now then, quests-wise, we still kind of have two main story quest strings here. Uh... Yeah, and it looks like the lower level one here is to uh, find out to go to Maker's End. Ah, that's exciting. I'm game for doing that. Uh, Aloy seeks to learn more about the mysterious woman who looks like her among the crumbling ruins of an ancient city. Uh, go to Maker's End and search for clues to the unknown woman's identity. Who was she? I'm game for that. Where are we going? Where is that? Very north. Cool. Let's go a-wandering. Normally, I'd grab a ride for this sort of hike, but I need to grab myself some healing herbs on the way there. And, uh, what's this? And going in with a ride tends to get me in trouble. And we're going into unexplored territory, so let's not go too wild. What's this? Uh, from Teresa Sanders to Sarah Peterson, your gift. Hi, Sarah. I want to thank you for your gift, but not for the reason you think. A little recap. I told you that I needed to enlist and fight this fight, that I'd be a coward not to do so. In response, you called me disloyal and shut me out for days. So, I do as I said I'd do. If you'll remember, I was the one in this relationship who actually did that and joined up. Did I know I was leaving you behind? Yes. Did I feel bad about it? Yes. Then two days into basic, I got a package from you. I open it and there's a gift inside. What's the gift? A stuffed armadillo. A stuffed armadillo? Am, am I kidding? No, not kidding. Attached to said armadillo is a note. What's the note say? Does it actually say, I'm sorry, hun, armadilling with some personal issues? Yes. I regret to inform you that the note does in fact say that, as though that, whatever you care to call that, begins to explain and justify your behavior, which is why I want to thank you. Talking to other enlistees, hearing them describe their girls and guys, I started to see us through a rose-colored filter. I was actually starting to wonder if I'd made the wrong choice, but that package and what it contained, what a wallet between the eyes that was. All doubts extinguished. You're an utter idiot, Sarah. A trivial, empty-headed imbecile. Given the choice between fighting killer robots and spending another day with you, hun, that ain't no choice at all. Don't contact me again. All right, so, I mean, that was all fun, but killer robots was their problem then, too. So, like, I guess the, the simplest explanation is we skynetted, made an AI, Gave it access to a bunch of robots that it could make killer robots, and, uh, got ourselves extincted. And that AI is still sort of at large, keeping us kind of, uh... Well, maybe not, like, at large, but just sort of lurking in the shadows and keeping us kind of limited to never be a threat again. That's probably overly simplistic. But it's what I got, for now. We'll keep the theory updated as events develop. A fork. This must be when the sign is supposed to check in. Hmm. What? We already dealt with that. What are you talking about? Ah, jeez. What am I hearing? Why? Why is? What on earth? Huh. What are you? You're just another one of those... Here comes a long leg! Oh, I see. Well, you know, I have an idea. Let's, um, try using a weapon that's real good against these. Not sure what it'll do to the, uh, nearby folk, but, um... Catch! Eh, could have been a better direct hit there. Come on. Catch! There we go. Now... Let's shoot these off. 
Get in some critical hits. Do some damage. Wallop on this thing a bit. That's a lot of fire. There we go. Not too shabby. Nice. Nice drop, too. So, uh... What was that about? Hmm, that was loud. What was that? Thought I heard something. Yeah. Boy, a snap moth sneaking up on me. That's no good. Maker's End. Not much farther now. Yeah, we're getting there. Someone said he found an image of the woman I resemble on an ancient device. If she's my mother, why would there be traces of her all the way out here? So far from Noraland. I don't get it. Who is she? Her name is Elizabeth Sobek. Oh. Hey, Lance. You. Spying through my focus again. <sighs> well, go on. What do you know about her? Stay on your present course before long. You'll know her as well as I do. Maybe better. But be wary. Maker's End is crawling with Eclipse troops. To help you deal with them, I've left some useful equipment just outside the ruins. Your focus will show the location. Hey, thank you. Who is he and how does he know these things? He said Elizabeth Selbeck. What kind of name is that? Sounds like we're going to be solving some more mysteries. Hmm, looks eclipsy. Still a ways off, though. We got a bandit camp here. We're gonna have to go through this, or can I go around? Where's my intern? Uh, maybe we better just go ahead and do it since we're here, huh? Yeah. Yeah, let's just do it. We're here. Why not? Let's find the one with the biggest gun. Fight Big or trouble. run. What? At least I found that one. Who You're saw dead. me? Dead. Oh, I didn't see all the way up there. So sneaky. You missed though, your aim's bad. Where's your head and all that? This'll ruin you. Eh, there we go. Found it. Alright, everyone, let's fight. Ooh, there's lots of gunners in here. That's fun. Or at least lots of boss rank enemies. Maybe they don't all have guns. But they should, if they're being considerate. That's not a gun. I don't think. That's just like a fancy bow. I already have so many of those. Hmm. Take that one down. No, don't do that. You feel this one? Yay! Catch. Anyone have any fancy guns that I can use? That's what I was most excited about. Do these even work on humans? I wonder. They do. Good work. Oh, you idiots. Alright, there's you. There's you. Ah, oh, it's going so well. Who needs stealth, anyway? Nice! Ah, oh, that felt good. Nice long range shot. Now go down. Go down! Down, I says. Thank you. 
I'm a bit tougher, that one. See, other than just taking headshots and occasionally using melee, I haven't really figured out a favorite anti-human enemy strategy. I mean, I guess this works, right? Works pretty well, overall. These have fire canisters on their back, right? I think they do. Oh, they got fire canisters somewhere. Yeah? Fire does work real well. Hey, level 30 reach. Look at me go. Ow. Fun little explosive sticks you got there. Wearing them down. Whoa, see, there's the gun I've been waiting for. Jeez. I was so patient. You took forever to show up. Maybe I should use these hard point ones on the uh, armored fellas. And get out of the way of this fire guy. No. Bad. Be on fire. Bad. Be on fire. Whoa. If you please. Thank you. Now where's this tough guy? I see him. You there. Nope. Don't hit me with that. Go down, please. There we go. I will be commandeering that gun. Don't Thank move. you. I gotta aim. And you're done. All right, now. Let's finish this, please. Who remains? Whoa, wow. Look at all this good stuff. I'm taking this later. Oh, there's still a bunch left. Okie dokie. Two business. Love this. This is the way to do it. I'm not here. Got one there. Search party starts now. That's probably the last one, right? Yeah, probably. Oh, hello. Here. Catch. Do you enjoy fireworks? There we go. Boy, that was a lot of them. Hooray, we did it. Let me go run around and clean house. Ah, got it all. And since we got some money and we've done so much good work, let's treat ourselves to an upgrade. Like our existing rope caster is like the green, uh, the uh, green rarity, relatively low level one. So let's go ahead and uh, get something better. The shadow rope caster, get some new stuff. Yeah. Ah, that's exciting. Let's go ahead and put in that slot there. Getting them upgrades. Awesome. Defeated. It's about time. And that'll give me some new tutorial missions to do in the off time. So loud. Sweet. What sort of new ammo does that come with? None? Maybe they're just, like, better. They just work a little faster. Which would be good, because I'm having to shoot, like, a lot of the uh, low-rank ones at robots to, uh, hold them down, so... This might be nice. Anyway. Enough bandit nonsense. Let's get out there. What's, uh... What's the hubbub? Ah, geez. What are these? Behemoths! Huh. That's new. Okay, uh... Let's see. Charges and overruns targets with its great bulk or uses lifting engines to launch rocks at range. Great. Uh, no body weaknesses. Lots of weaknesses on that crate holder thing. Destroying this will detach the cargo containers, whatever that does. Freeze canister in the back. Force loader. Uh, destroying this component disables the lifting attacks. 
and a power cell also on the very back. Okay. Some tricky shots there, but getting rid of these on the side and the crate holders seem interesting. So, um, I guess let's do something stupid. Uh, oh, we can try this out at least. That'll be fun. Uh, yeah. Boy, they look rad, though. Those are freeze canisters on the back, right? I think they are. Ah, whatever. I can get out of this. Yeah. Look at you losing parts. Wow, it's cool seeing trees come down. Okay. Let's uh detach some nonsense. Watch out. Hey, come chase me. Come on. What, are you distracted by something? Maybe I should, uh, set some traps. Woo! Don't love that. Not one bit. I need to, uh... What is it that's necessary to get rid of that? I'd love to know. See, getting rid of those gets rid of the lifting attack. Getting rid of this... Uh, doesn't stop anything. Is there any way to get rid of that? Hmm. I'm guess maybe that's the lifting attack. If I can destroy those, maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, I really don't want to be fighting two of them. No, I don't. Nor those. There's a lot to deal with. I need to get equipped with other stuff here, real quick. This is all very intimidating. Uh, let's get this out in... One of these slots. Boy, I kind of want all of them right now, but uh, let's start with this. Not loving that. Please stop. Get shock, please. Good enough. Okay. Boy, I <laughs> keep on needing to shuffle inventory, which is not the best, but uh, it's a tense moment if there was ever a time. I don't know if that really helped against those two, but uh, better than nothing. Yeah, this is all bad. All very bad. Let's try our new thing. Get held down, please. Perfect. Okay. Now for you. Lose stuff, please. Ah, geez. Too much. Too much. Get out of the water, please. Not a place to be. Wow, that's something. Man, those tripwires or the rope caster things are great. Okay, well, we made this guy lose its cargo. Maybe that's just a loot drop of sorts. Please lose more stuff. Yes, good. It's still so sturdy and durable, I hate it. Why are you not dead? At least that. Oh, boy. I feel like I still haven't figured out their weak point or anything. Please go down. While I worry about your friend. Gotcha. Hold still. Thank you. Now this one. Okay. Concentrating. Uh... Body is weak to nothing, but it is strong against shock, so that's a waste of time. Uh, can do damage by removing that, and maybe get some loot later. Freeze canister. Shooting this will trigger a freeze explosion, which, not bad. Uh, 
Destroying these disables the lifting attacks, which I'm still not sure what is, but I'd rather they not have this. Destroying the power cell. Will trigger an explosion, electrifying everything in the area, which not isn't going to do a whole lot against these two, so maybe just knocking it off will do some basic damage to them, which sure is better than nothing. Come on, lose it. Wow. He's not interested in losing that, huh? Gee, Willikers. I want you to not have that anymore. Thank you. Can I get a critical hit in? That's what I'd love right now. Seems like you're not giving me that, though. Okay. You are a problem right now. Bad. Oh, boy. It's all bad right now. Mmm, stop blocking. There. That's what I needed right there. This is gonna hurt. Yep. At least that's dead. Uh, okay. This is all just a mess. But I'm living so far. Huh, what's in these? Anything good? <laughs> Come on. It's kind of hoping for some like healing potions or something for free, but whatever. Can't have everything. I'll go ahead and make some. Let's drink the health boost potion. I haven't ever had one of those. Yeah, that's nice. Ah, jeez. Okay. Let's see if I can pin you again. Stop doing that. Okay. It's down again, which is great. Maybe. Ugh. This is not a great way to fight these, seems like. That's okay. That's how we learn. Um, what am I looking for? That. Right? Yes. Oh, I forgot about your buddy. Okay. That's the oh, wrong thing. My bad. This is what I meant. Please do. More ammo. Please go down. It would mean the world to me. I'm going to set some more traps now. Great. Also gonna try hitting you with some of this nonsense. So you can't keep this stuff anymore. Please run into explosions for me. Bring it on over. Great. Why are you so durable? I disapprove. This is doing it, though, slowly. Come get me. I don't think I have anything else to break off on you. Go down. Oh my gosh. Would you go down? Thank you. Good heavens. I'm using like everything I got. Whoops. Wrong thing, but maybe? Why not? Blow up. 
Now run into my traps, please. Thank you. Go down. I really would love to get critical hits on y'all when you're down like this. I guess I just can't do that. Um, this seems a little cheeky, but um, what about this? <laughs> yeah, let's not do that anymore. Oh boy, we're gonna die. 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 Ah! I got so close. I was doing so good. Well, I wasn't doing so good, but I got so close. Yeah, I broke off, like, all of their materials, but I don't feel like I know how to finish that fight there. Like, I can get them down to half health, but then what? I guess I could try freezing them. Because then more of my other attacks do more damage. That's actually probably the strategic thing to do. I should wrap this episode up, but I will try that fight one more time, just because I'm being stubborn. Okay. Got these two, and the one long leg. I feel like there's another one just looming. But, um, yeah. If I can get the long leg first, just take it out of the picture, that'll solve some chaos problems. Not a lot of them, but, um, you know? Let me go ahead and put, uh, some stuff in these slots. More tear damage. Can't hurt. What on earth? Whoa, that's awesome. I didn't see that before. Awesome and terrifying. Everything's bad. Let's, um... Boy. There's just so much to focus on. You go down. You lose stuff, please. I do not want you having stuff anymore. Good heavens. Boy, oh boy. Please lose stuff. I'm gonna go finish this one real fast. Ah, good heavens. Break. Ah. That's a terrifying move, if ever I saw one. You also need to go down. Thank you. Now, you start losing parts. Come on. Ow. Go down. Thank you. You both need to be losing components like yesterday. Good. Now. All right, best way to go about freezing these two. Probably this. Yeah. Let's do some freezing.
All right, you're frozen now. Come get some. And I'm gonna try doing some damage to you now that you're weakened. Oh, this is so slow. Boy, oh boy. It never ends. Ah, all right, well, come back this way then. Hit all the explosives, please. And I'm gonna need one or both of you to go back down, because uh, two at once, can't do it. Oh no, bad. Very bad. You should not still have all these components. I thought I got rid of them all. Clearly I did not. Oof. Come on. Ah, okay. No, that's just a fight that I cannot win. Not right now. And not until I learn some more strategies and get some more better gear, perhaps. That's all right. We'll get there. Used to be we felt that way about, like, much smaller now less scary enemies so we'll get there y'all have yourselves a good one and i'll see y'all on friday for some more horizon and hopefully some mystery solving y'all take care and goodbye